This is a cine hall which is nearly 60 years old and there was a pioneering spirit at that time that brought a community together and gave it a really relevant space. We now are at a stage where we can move another step on. We've got a growing community. Now it's time to create a building which matches and mirrors that as well. A very warm welcome to the Ladies' Gallery. Well, I would say a warm welcome, but given that it's the middle of April, it is absolutely freezing. And that is a problem with the Ladies' Gallery. We have really poor ventilation, which means in the summer we are absolutely schwitzing, and in the winter we are absolutely freezing. Not only for the women of Muswell Hill will the ventilation mean an improvement in terms of the heat and the temperature. By improving the window lighting, it means we could be seen in all our glory with the correct fashion, the correct season and the correct temperature. So here in the Bet Midrash, uh, where we are now, the shape isn't really conducive for an inclusive prayer space. Uh, having a place for women here really never works and it's really difficult and embarrassing to be honest. We could use this space as a multi-purpose room, have lectures here, have audio equipment in here to make it a really great prayer space and a great room that services the community. And by knocking this room through, we have a bigger space. We've got a chance to really make it even more beautiful as a room. I'm Lois and I've been a member of Muswell Hill Synagogue for about 10 years now. I definitely spend more time in the kitchen than I do upstairs in the women's gallery. I run the cooking club and members of the community cook for members of the community who need support. Um, we also cook for wonderful charitable organisations, both Jewish and non-Jewish. And I mention this because it's really important that you understand the wide range of activities that are happening and how much we rely um, upon the use of the kitchen and the facilities. And fundamentally, the kitchen is not fit for purpose. The ovens don't work. It should be very simple to bake a cake, but in order for a cake to cook and rise in this kitchen is actually a miracle. My experience with Shul Security is that being on a main road, we underestimate how important it is to be prepared and to protect from any threats, any dangers. The most important thing is that we need to have fencing that is protected, that is much higher, and that people cannot easily bombard cars, throwing things at it, or anything else. We also don't have, at the moment, a room just for all the security, for the monitors, for the bulletproof vests, stab proof vests, which are mandatory now. We're standing in the tribe rooms where we have activities for the youth and children's services and things like that. It's a good room. A major issue is the heating. If it's really cold, we just don't use it and we use somewhere else, which is not great. Issue number two is it's a lovely big room, but we can only use it as a lovely big room. So having the partition is going to make a huge difference to firstly the acoustics of so smaller spaces and then we can use it more efficiently, have two classes, two activities and things going on. Young people in our community are the future of our community, ensuring that they have a space in the shul that feels like it's theirs is a big part of keeping them in the community so that they'll come back in the future, so that they'll enjoy it while they're here, they'll have a positive opinion and outlook on the shore in general. The plans that we are moving forward on are plans that can unite the community. That's a vision that we have come to together, a vision that can take us forward. And to use that building in the service of that vision, I think gives Muswell Hill Synagogue a really great horizon. Please give generously. This building work really is essential. The improved ventilation and the lighting will really improve the quality for the women when they come up to Shul to pray. Help Muswell Hill be a secure place for everyone to come to. Thank you. Funding these improvements will ensure that families and the whole community can come together as one in a space that is right for them. We can't make these improvements to the Shul building without your help. We're all part of the same community and we have to work together to dig deep and be generous and make this happen. So I would say to all those watching, this is your chance to be part of a pioneering generation in the Muswell Hill Synagogue community that will create a building that will give us another generation, at least, of growth 
and a vibrant community for all.